Good morning, family. Um, Domino and I are out walking this morning. Guys, even though the gym is closed, um, I am still walking the apartments to try to get some exercise, lose some weight, to get healthier, and to get out of the house because the girl do not like to be quarantined anywhere. <laughs> so, um, being out, the birds are chirping, it's a nice cool breeze, kind of misty out here, and no one's outside. So, makes it nice. I can just walk outside and enjoy myself. And um, so I hope everyone is doing well this morning. Um, I know they put it in effect now that, um, at least I know at the Dollar Generals, that um, the first hour of service, which starts at 8, uh, of opening their building, they um, cater that to the elderly only. So 60 and up are allowed to go in, you know, to keep them safe. They have an hour to shop. And then they, uh, then others can come, you know, to shop after we get, they get all the elderly out. So that's good. They're taking precaution on that to keep, um, you know, everyone safe. Okay, so my plans today, guys, is to, um, I walk the dog a couple times around the apartments. I am going to go ahead and start planting the spring seeds um, so they can start growing. I went and got some green bean seeds last night. I guess I used the ones from last year. I used them all up. I did pretty good with my green beans. So um, that is what I'm going to plant this morning. Some okra because it did really well. And, um, and it doesn't take that long before I can start having some produce from that. So I'm going to get the dog in the house and then we're gonna go on the patio and start working on working on our seeds getting them planted in and um so let me know in the comments what are you doing to um keep yourself busy what are you doing with your kids i know a lot of y'all um have to stay home yeah just let me know what y'all are up to and what do y'all what plans do y'all have to do since you have to get really creative with kids i guess to entertain them i know a lot of them have been getting on social media if you've been talking thinking about if you've been thinking about starting a youtube channel this is a great time to do it because everyone's in the house and so they're trying to find netflix and uh youtube channels to watch great time to get started on your youtube channel and um yeah I see y'all on the patio. Okay, family, I have made it to the patio and I have some um, some items here. I put all my seeds in this little box here. And um, what I'm going to do is try to plant a few things. I don't wanna plant so much because I'm going to be moving and that's gonna be enough trying to carry all these plants with me. So I do have the seed whoops the seed starter pot um these are biodegradable so if i need to plant them in a bigger dirt i can just plant them from here which is a 40 count of those i think i got them three dollars i think they were on sale i think it was a dollar fifty um at the dollar store and then we have these two containers here i do have more but like i said i'm not going to plant too much stuff right now I also have these here and I paid 50 cents for these and it's six cups in here they're also biodegradable I already have the pre-made hole in them and um, so I some items that I will be putting in the dirt or planting I'm gonna do again with my okra that worked out really well last year the okra was delicious and i figure if i plant them now um i should have some okra before we move and then we have 
this is baby leaf spinach yeah baby leaf spinach wasn't able to grow this last year so maybe with this kind of cooler weather i'll be able to we have some onions i'm going to do the spanish variety of the chili long stem red we have some green beans and this year i made sure right there in that corner where it says bush yeah your girl made sure she got bush beans this time and not the pole beans that grow everywhere um yeah we want sharp bush beans to have what else we're gonna do um we're also going to do these right let me make sure um no these may be the ones i don't think these bush snap these may I don't know if these pole or not. It says bush snap. So uh <laughs> kind of leery on that one. And then we have also these little um, clay plot pots. I don't know if they're clay. Whatever. And they have pre-drilled holes in them. I have some labels right here. And uh, for my lettuce, since I have a lettuce uh, label right there. So I'm just going to plant these up this morning oops blurry okay i'm gonna plant these up this morning i have um let's see what i have over here i have the potting soil and then we have some some of this this was from the tomatoes and um so we have this dirt here and then i have some bone meal that i got last year and all-purpose food plant uh food based plant whatever and uh so yeah i'm gonna plant it i have my peppers still sitting here i haven't cut them back yet just letting them do their thing um all my plants are really looking pretty good there's some more um the peppers are getting larger right there so at the while we'll be having some nice little peppers these are uh those are which ones are those the macho nacho they haven't got big as they supposed to they supposed to be the ones that you can uh fill up and um like cream cheese and stuff in there and make nice jalapenos but i don't know and then we have a little deer lizard this morning look at him in there look he's like what are you doing this is my pineapple tree guys this is going on the third year um uh, with this so it should be growing something eventually coming out of there we have my palms right here i'm just showing y'all everything while i'm out here this is my bamboo which need to be cleaned out all those dead leaves i didn't show y'all my new plants that i got um about two weeks ago this is a tomatillo oh i can't wait and look at all the flower and blooms on those look at that Oop, it's blurring look at that they are so pretty and then over here we have poblano peppers which i love those there we go and um they have a little bit right there whoops can you see them yeah they are starting to come to have some little buds on them this is my aloe vera just sitting back here and look at lillian Lillian, you leaning, girl. Let's put you back up here. Lillian has bloomed, guys. Look at that. You remember my poor little uh, plant that I rescued? Oh, stay still, Lillian. Oh, she's strong. I'm going to have to tie her up right there. Um, remember my rescue plant? Look how gorgeous she is. Y'all seen her in a picture, but I didn't say who she was at the end of a video. Um, but this is Lillian, guys. <laughs> she has grown. Her leaves are so beautiful and healthy. Now, ones that don't know and they're like, who is Lillian? A lady at our apartments, an elderly lady, she had many plants and she loved her plants. And when she passed away, they threw all the plants and stuff and cleaned out the apartment. Well, I seen this plant. It was small and shriveled. 
kind of like I don't know if it was gonna live but now look at it it started blooming because I thought it was one of the plants that don't have blooms and it's just these leaves but look at that beautiful I mean nice beautiful plant so it, this is my way of just being able to have um, that lady to still live through her plants and it just it man it touches my heart to be able to keep this alive anyway guys i am going to get into doing these um these plants oh i also wanted to show you this before i get started this here guys i went to um what was it a flea market i went to a flea market uh what last year and um the lady, these are towels that she dipped in concrete, and she makes these concrete towels. She already have a pre-drilled hole in there, and she said these are great to um, use for your plants because it soaks in the water and it lets water out. It's kind of porous. It doesn't look like it, but it's really porous, <clears throat> and so the water is able to seep through there, and it's one of them cloth pots. It's pretty much one of the cloth pots that you have but it has um, the structure you can paint this to have it beautiful but I like the gray so anyway I would be using that also so I'm gonna get to it with these and I will get back with okay you. guys so I have finished doing my planting and like I said I'm just doing a small set of plants um, we have chili um, cayenne peppers okras iceberg lettuce we have a spinach in these, green beans, different type in these. Um, I refilled my pepper containers so they can have some fresh soil on them. Look at this pepper, guys. Ooh, it's getting pretty. Look at that. Nice. And then this one here. Then this one here. So they are going well. I have more blooms going on right there and i put some lettuce in this with this palm tree i don't know what you're supposed to do that but eh, i'm gonna see if it'll grow there anyway so that's what i just wanted to show you on my little my little patio plants i did get my garden started like i said i'll probably plant more after i move and figure out what kind of sunlight i'm going to be getting um and patio and all that kind of stuff so anyway guys if you haven't hit that subscribe button to join this family go ahead and do that so you can be a part and hit me with a like on this video guys and I'll see you on the next vlog bye